So we got a terra bird attack. Look how fast it is. Welcome back, dinosaur members, to Jurassic World Evolution 2. I'm the talking T Rex, and welcome to a new species showcase. It is none other than the Forest Rackers, aka the Terror Bird. And oh my word, look at that killing machine! It looks awesome. First, in the species viewer, we're going to showcase all these skins and the basic animations, and later on, we'll actually release it and have it battle against Raptors, T Rexes, and even with. The breakout. So, without further ado, this mod was created by a Trippy28 with the help of Viral Cyclops, Hyper SG, and Net Raptor. And my God, look at that thing! It looks absolutely beautiful, and it's ready to kill horses. Yes, this is a world where birds <laughs> kill. We don't have horses in this game, sadly enough. Yeah, there should have been a mod. Oh well, it might hunt down a goat or any other dinosaur later on, but. Look at it. Wow. It looks so cool. We, of course, want to have an official Jurassic World Evolution 2 update or DLC with Cenozoic creatures like a saber tooth, uh, cat like the uh, Smilodon, and etc. But right now, mods will have to do, and I, with that, I do need to mention if you want to check out these mods yourself, it's your re um, responsibility and not on Frontiers if anything happens to your uh, game. So do understand that when you're installing the Terror Bird. But look at that. The overall model, there are some glitches with the eye, and I think the wings when it actually runs. But look at it. It looks so good. Let's uh, quickly view it at night time. Oh my god, that is absolutely terror. <laughs> terror. Oh wait, terror, but yeah, that makes sense. So here we go. This is the first roaming animation. I'm not too sure which rigging the terror bird is on, but it suits it so well. I'm guessing one of the raptors, one of the bigger raptors, but the neck is so long of the of the terror bird in here, so I'm kind of wondering how they made the rigging work. I'm trying to figure out what it, the rigging re got replaced by for the terror bird to actually work because, wow, it's an actual working terror bird in Jurassic World Evolution 2, and oh, this would have been so cool, and maybe in the future. Who knows, it will be an actual thing. So first off, we're going through all the patterns, of course. This is one of the default patterns. Feel free to pause the video if you want to check out every skin pattern which you like the best. So we have all the colors. I think most of the colors actually change on the beak and the overall main body itself. Even the feathers on top, I see, are now actually changing. Which is pretty cool. And uh, we, of course, gonna make color patterns like the Walking with Beasts and Primeval Terror Birds. Because the uh, Forest Rackers, of course, got featured in these two shows, which we are all very familiar of. <laughs> Oh, even the, the top of the beak is even colored in with different patterns. That's nice. And then we have the blank pattern, as you can see right here. So, yes, that is that. Now, let's head in game because I can't wait to release it. And here we are with the mod showcase in park. As you can see, I made a little bit of a desert-like theme enclosure because it's uh, terror birds, uh, the forest rackers, used to live in South America in deserts with the smaller dot, of course, the clash between them. You've seen the documentaries. Anyways, in here we have a single terror bird to kind of see the release animation. And then we have a batch of three and maximum of five with, of course, the primeval and walking with bee skin. And they will battle against blue, the uh, prologue feathered tyrannosaurus because the terror bird is a feathered. So I'll try to include the T-Rex as a feathered. Then we have the therizinosaurus with the dreadnoughtus because they replace like raptor like rigging. Hopefully they can pack hunt a sauropod and hunt down a parasaur. Well, for saw had to saw in general and later on we'll actually see if they can also hunt down the humans Danny Quinn and Connor Temple are never safe. So without further ado Yes, are you excited as I am because I am and let's release it Oh, oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. That's one beautiful bird. Oh wow, I wish my bird at home looked like this. That is so cool. Look at the p color patterns on that. Oh wow, even without the primeval one and stuff like that. Look at the basic, even at the at the legs there. This is an awesome skin pad. Look at this thing. 
Wow! I mean, I can see how they would implement a swallow and you would just place it on the Dimetrodon rigging, but this one, I can't tell which raptor stands up like this. And it kind of sounds like a terror bird as well. Oh, it's a bit. Alright, okay, well, let's rename it to Terror Bird, and there we are. So, let's see. Dislike carnivores and a Therizinosaurus, of course. Now, let's view the database for it. Uh, if you want, you can actually pause the video and have a quick read through, but I'll quickly read the description. Forest Rackers was a medium sized terror bird from Argentina during the uh, Miocene uh, epoch. Uh, it is the namesake of the family of Forest Rachidae, uh, a group that also consists of Titanus, Kalenkin, Gastornis, and many others. Forest Rachidae was one of the dominant land predators of its ecosystem, all thanks to its powerful legs, long neck, agility, swift speed, and of course, its sharp and hooked beak. That is awesome. Okay, so here we go. Oh, it looks so good. Looks so good, even though it doesn't like have feathers on the main body that um, will probably cause some uh, problems for the rigging. But I'm sure Frontier could make it work. Wing wing Frontier. Okay, so here we go. Next up, we have the Walking with Beasts inspired skin with the clear orange beak and the red kind of body. The closest to it, at least. And it looks awesome. Look at the long, like the. Oh my, there's something about the running where it takes large steps, not like small ones that the raptors do. As you, uh, of course, with the chase scene of Danny Quinn in the car in season 3 of Primeval, they, they take long steps and sometimes very short, but most of the time they use these large steps when running and that looks so good. And right now it looks like it has it in this game as well somehow, I don't know, but it looks amazing. So, finally. We have the primeval terror birds. Oh, that looks so cool. Oh, look at that. That's amazing. Look, look at the long, see that? And that Jeep almost, it, it does it with every raptor species. I, I don't know why that is. <laughs> but the, the Jeep has a knack of trying to ram um, raptors and now even a terror bird. Look at that. Have a chasey with the thing. Yeah, that's awesome. Here, give me the wheel. Give me the wheel. Awesome. Chase us. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> is it actually running with us? Yeah, that one is. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. <laughs> Even a goat. It is Oh, it looks so good. Look at it running. Oh, wait, hold on. Why is there a gate? Oh, <laughs> why is that gate open? It is already running and breaking out. I didn't actually meant to do that. Why was that gate open? Oh, it was for the Jeep. Of course it was for the Jeep. Everyone's running right now. Whoa, a quick preview of the breakout. Great job, Jeep. <laughs> that is just trying to... Oh, just trying to hunt down the, the ARC members. Yes, the ACU members in this universe, the two franchises collide, it's just stunned that it's out here. While you are out there, let's release the other dinosaurs that are in here, and for that I'll just release all of them. That's awesome, you are definitely smaller than them. And here we have the T-Rex, of course, there we go. And then we have the Therizinosaurus, desert-like skin with it, of course, themed, same as the Dreadnoughtus. Look at that, absolutely beautiful. They're running away and this one is actually drinking. I do want to see that. If you're already done, no, they're running towards the feeder. I do want to see them eat from the, the feeder, which I think will look very cool as well. So let's view it. Let's view it. Oh, that looks awesome. Oh, that looks so cool. Oh my word, it's amazing. I'm shocked. That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, so let's see if any battles are going to happen. We already have one, I think. What? Died with T- Oh my word, that- In fight with a Tyrannosaurus. I did not expect that. But here we go. We have a Terra Bird versus a Velociraptor Blue. Here we go. Who's going to win? Oh, but that was a peck by the Terra Bird. It's amazing. Yes, our oh, blue is not looking so good. It doesn't even have any modifications on it, but it's demolishing blue. Oh, that is a quick... Oh, it looks so good! Oh my word, it fits it so perfectly in the Lost World Theater as well. 
we've got the Therizinosaurus versus what of the um, walking with beasts. Yeah, terror birds. Look at that enormous oh cloth. Look at that, so cool. Looks so cool. Okay, let's see who's going to win this battle. We've already got some people watching in the background. We've got a new species and oh! Oh, <laughs> that was an instant kill by the Therizinosaurus. Yeah, that is the real terror bird. Oh, another one I missed out. One of the T-Rexes hunted down another one. Maybe we need to incubate more of them. And I kind of want to see another release animation of all of them. Look at that. Look at the one running. Where's the other one? Oh, there it is. It looks so cool. Okay, so here we go. Oh my word, they're now turning against each other. But I do want to see that though. Oh, a quick snap between both of them. Oh, now the T-Rex is just great doing the pterosaurs' work. And there it goes, of course. The pterosaurs are supposed to do that. Oh, look at the T-Rex being surrounded by the pterosaurs. That was pretty cool, actually, but they're just... Straight up running away. And looks like Blue has gone down. And I've got another announcement. It is a T-Rex. Is this actually going to be a battle? Yes, it is. But it's not going to last long. Yeah, Blue just got like, yeah, pecked by the Terror Bird and then fell down. And same with the T-Rex. But T-Rex did Blue a favor. Actually, now that I see, it cannot sh be shared with, of course, a Therizinosaurus. But it can, oh yeah, there it goes. But it can be shared with a Dreadnoughtus or Parasaurolophus. So they won't actually pack hunt a Sauropod, as you can see right here, or a Parasaurolophus. So these two are, were actually safe all along from them. I guess they're very careful on who they attack. It seemed like in the <laughs> documentary, actually, they didn't like go full Rampage mode on the Smilodons. So oh, we got a terror bird attack! Oh. oh, yeah, it's a little bit glitched, but you saw what was happening. Oh, it, it suits so well! It's the same attack as in Primeval. It's the exact same, and this long distance running. Oh, it's so fast as well. Look how fast it is! Oh my word, it's going for it! Oh, oh, brutal. Oh, that's so brutal, I love it. We've got another terror bird out. Oh my word, they're so incredibly fast. Look at that. I love how it likes... Yeah, like that. Oh, at the neck of the human. I can only imagine. I can only picture it in my head. Oh, that looks so cool. Terror bird, watch out. Danny, watch out. Hold on to your... <laughs> oh, now that's cool. It actually roared at me there. Now we're chasing. Yeah, how do you like it now, my friend? Hunting down you now. <laughs> That looks cool, I won't deny. Well, they're rampaging through Jurassic World. I'm going to end this mod showcase episode here. Let me know what you think of this mod down below. Make sure to like, subscribe, and ring that bell notification if you want to get notified for more mod showcases in Jurassic World Evolution 2 in the future. Now, I hope all of you lovely dinosaur members are going to have a great day. So, all you lovely Cenozoic members in the next episode. Goodbye, the talking T-Rex. Out.